In this video, we are going to talk about top 10 ways, tips to apply for a job online. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Many of your job applications will be completed online, either directly on an employer's website or through a job board, when you're looking for a new job. You should get ready to fill out online job applications before you start looking for work. It necessitates gathering all of the necessary information to apply. If you have all of the employment information that employers require on hand, it will be easier to submit your applications. Examine the best job searching sites, how to upload your resume and cover letter, the information you'll need to provide, and how to make the application process go more smoothly. What you need to apply. Number 10. Apply Now button. You'll need internet access, an email address to use for job searching, an up-to-date resume, a cover letter for some jobs, your employment history, and your availability to work if you're applying for a part-time job to apply for a job online. You may also be required to take an online employment test as part of the job application process, and you must be prepared to provide employment references. Number 9. Get your resume ready. You'll need an updated version of your resume ready to upload before you start looking for jobs and filling out online job applications. To apply for some jobs, you may also need a cover letter. Make certain that your resume contains your current contact information as well as your work history. Rather than using a generic file name like, resume, save your resume as your name resume.doc. When the hiring manager reviews the resume, the hiring manager will be able to connect you to it. Here are some suggestions for naming your resume and cover letter. Prepare a generic cover letter that you can tweak for each job you apply for. Unless the job description specifically states otherwise, you should always include a cover letter when applying for a job. With the click of a button, some websites allow you to upload an existing resume from your computer's Microsoft Word program. You may be asked to convert a document to a PDF or another type of file on occasion. You may need to copy and paste your resume into an online profile or use a resume builder integrated into the job application system on other sites. Number 8. Be well versed in your work history. Prepare a list of all of your previous jobs. Online application systems typically request the same information as paper job applications, such as your contact information, educational background, and work history, which includes job titles, start and end dates, and salary for each position. You may require the full address of your previous employers, as well as the company's phone number and the name of your supervisor. Number 7. Review Sample Job Application Forms Before you begin your online job applications, download a sample job application form and fill it out. Print it out and fill it out so you'll know exactly what information to put in when applying for jobs online. When you're filling out your job applications, use the completed sample job application as a reference. Also, to prepare for filling out job applications, review this list of questions asked on a job application. Number 6. Create accounts on job sites. When applying for jobs on some job boards and company websites, users are required to create an account. Create an account on at least one of the major job boards, such as Monster, CareerBuilder, and Dice for Tech Jobs, to begin your online job search. It's also important to create a LinkedIn profile if you're looking for a professional position. To create an account, you must provide a valid email address so that your account can be verified. Either your email address or a name you choose will serve as your username. You will be given the option of selecting a password for your account. Some websites allow job seekers to register using information from Facebook or LinkedIn. You'll be able to log in with your Facebook or LinkedIn username and password on those sites. You might also be able to import your work history from the website where you connect. Number 5. Upload a resume or a candidate profile to the internet. Most job boards have a system for job seekers to upload their resumes. You'll be able to use your resume to quickly apply for jobs on the site after you've uploaded it. You may be able to make your resume viewable for employers depending on the site, which will increase the visibility of your job search. Number 4. Use job search keywords. When searching for jobs online, the most effective method is to use job keywords to locate jobs in the fields and industries that interest you. Because keywords search the entire listing, job description, job title, contact information, etc., 
For the keywords you use, they can be more effective than using the predefined search options in job banks. Make a list of job search keywords that reflect your professional interests, such as the location you want to work, the type of position you want, the industry you want to work in, and so on. Also, look over these skill lists for resumes so you can match your abilities to the job requirements. Number 3. Search for jobs online. Aside from using job boards, which post jobs submitted by employers, using a job search engine can save you a lot of time when it comes to looking for work online. You can search for jobs across multiple job boards and employer websites using a job search engine. For example, the job search engine LinkUp only looks for job openings on company websites, so all of the results will be current positions. Indeed.com searches for job openings on job boards, newspapers, trade associations, and company websites, including the majority of Fortune 1000 firms. You'll get a list of job openings that match your specifications very quickly if you search using the job search keywords list you created. When you click on a job opening, you'll be given instructions on how to apply as well as a link to the company's website where you can apply. Number 2. Apply for jobs on company websites. Company websites are a great place to look for job openings, especially if you already know which companies you want to work for. Many company websites allow you to go straight to the site and search for and apply for jobs. You can apply for all levels of positions online at most companies, from part-time hourly jobs to top management positions. Even if you find the job listing elsewhere, apply directly on the company's website whenever possible. Your application will be automatically entered into the company's applicant tracking system, where you can track its progress. Number 1. When are you available to work? You may be asked what days and hours you are available to work, especially if you are applying for part-time jobs. Before you apply, make sure you have a clear idea of your schedule and availability. If you have a flexible schedule, make sure to mention it in your job application and later in your interview. Employers value candidates who are willing to work a variety of hours and shifts that others may not be interested in, such as night, evening, or weekend shifts. What do you think about our list? Do you have any tips to share with us? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoy this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications before you go. Thanks for watching.